Good morning, everybody. I met this young lady in Houston when I was in the hospital. Her name is Shay, and she was supposed to be seen uh, visiting with me uh, the day I went to go see Dr. Garth on Monday. Well, she didn't get to, and I met Chantree. And she was going to be in Dallas this week, and she met with me, and she said, I've got some things to give you. I said, okay, so she brought me some clothes and stuff, and people, she did not just bring me a little box of clothes. She brought me a container of clothes, so let me show you. You see that pink container right there? It was full of stuff. Um, in the container right now, I have uh, some plastic Rubbermaid containers, uh, some more. She got me some jewelry. I'm wearing it today, Shay. I love it. And she got me a necklace and some stuff for my hair, and I left it in the other room. Sorry. Uh, these are some toe rings. These are some more blouses in here. Uh, this is a tape, Cure for the Worry by um, Joyce Myers, which is amazing. And I got all these clothes on my bed. There's so much to show. But I'm going to do just a quick view of it. Um, this is an actual suit here, a black suit. These are black pants. This is a striped suit. These are three pairs of blue jeans that I still can't get into. But, you know, um, my size in pants are like a size... 26 still, um, but they fit me really big from the top uh, on the waist, but that's okay. Uh, I'm using the elastic -y ones that uh, Angie gave me. She got me this purse. It's brand new. I like it because I could take that my uh, swim stu my uh, uh, stuff to go to the swim uh, gym with, so I like that. Um, she gave me three of these blouses in different colors. Um, there's a brown one and a gray one, and I got a suit so I can sweat my butt off, <laughs> which I like. Um, this is a whole suit right here, uh, a jacket, a pair of pants, another pair of pants, uh, shorts, some sleeping wear outfits, some more shirts, a blouse, and some stuff I hung up real quick. I love this blouse. Isn't it pretty? It's yellowy. Um... A dress. See, so you could see the whole view of the dress. It doesn't fit yet, but it will. And another dress. Cool. With pockets. <laughs> okay. So, what am I doing today? What are we doing today? We are headed out to the zoo. Yes, we are. On Monday, Alfred said, Babe, you want to go to the zoo? I'm thinking, the zoo? I haven't been there since Rosemary was here, and that was in October, and I hadn't been there since I was a kid. So, it was hard for me to get up and down those hills, so we will see. So, thank you, Shay, for the love and for you to come all, out, all the way out here to bring me this package. I just loved it, and I loved visiting with you. I love you, Shay. Mm, till we'll meet again. Bye. See you in a little bit. Okay, we're headed out. <laughs> I got Alfred packed up with some um, Luna bars and some Gatorade and some water. We're gonna get to walking. Go on hiking in the zoo, baby. Okay, now let them see my my outfit that I have on. All right. Look at okay. my <laughs> This is what I have on. I don't really like to show my belly, but I got some, you know what on. Turn around, some huh? Tight underwear. Yeah, give me the whole thing then. All righty. Look at that. Booty. Looking good. <laughs> and uh, what else was I going to say? Yeah, I got some tight stuff on. Oh, I've got my pedometer on. So we'll see how many steps we're going to do. Babe, did you get your pedometer? No. You don't need your pedometer? No. Okay. Well, anyway. All right. See you in a little bit. Mm -hmm. Bye. Bye-bye. Thank you. 
Yeah. Isn't that adorable, babe? Yeah. They come to see down here at the water. If I can get down here. Oh, look at them. How adorable. Oh, yeah. We're under a mist. This is so cute. Loving it. Are you enjoying it? Oh, yeah. Very good. A breeze just blew. Uh-huh. <coughs> Perfecto. Because <laughs> it is a hot day today, is it not? Yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. Feels good in the shade with the right? breeze blowing. Right. Yeah. What are we looking at? Gorillas. No, a gorilla. And I feel sad for him. Where is he? Can you see him? Let's see. He's way over there. Which he looks sad. He looks so sad. Aw. Oh, I know how he feels on a hot day like this. People just watching him. You know what I mean? He got me to thinking. Don't like that feeling. See you in a little bit. It's only birdies in there, right? Right, right. Birdie, birdie, birdie. Aw, they're all flying. Cool. <laughs> We're recording. Yeah. We'll be taking a picture and she's taking a video. I messed it up. Okay. <laughs> we're having still a great time, even though we're burning up, because it is hot out here. We're probably in the, what, 95, 98 degrees out here. Whoo-wee! Is this not nice? The breeze is nice, isn't it, Daddy? Yeah. And the mystery is making it even better. The what? The mystery. Yeah, the mystery. <laughs> oh, that air feels so good on me. I do declare. Non-scale victory. I'm able to sit in this chair very comfortably. Woohoo! I can't get in there, babe. Can you see? Babe. Hmm? Get me, get me, like, in the chair. Because these chairs are narrow. He's enjoying his bath. <laughs> oh yeah. There's another one over there.
Lily, very nice to meet you. Why don't you stand right here next to me and face the audience, because they're going to want to see you do this, okay? I'm going to give you this grape, and I'm going to say, one, two, three, go. On go. You're going to toss that grape straight up above your head right in this area right here. Can you do that? Okay, Lily, hold on to that grape while I get my bird back. Ready, Mel? Okay, Mel's ready. Here we go, Lily. One, two, three, go! It's up! Yeah! Awesome now, job, Lily. Lily. Do you remember that little bird that came out and recycled a minute ago? His name is Ike. Let's see if we can get him back out here. Hey, Ike. Cool, you Catherine. Out Your granddaughter's Lily? name, Lily. Volunteer. We're going to get you a little gift. So, uh, oh, hey, Ike, can you bring it over here? <laughs> Why'd you put it way over there? I can't reach that. Oh, man, I'm going to need a little bit of help. You know, those little guys, those kids, they're very mischievous. They're found out in New Zealand, and they're known as the clowns of the mountains. Thank you very much. Because they live in alpine regions and... And you guys will see that in a minute. Owls often look a lot like tree bark, so they blend in really well in the forest. The other one is called silent flight, which basically means that an owl can fly through the air without making hardly any noise. Now, most birds, when they fly, they flap in their wings, move in a lot of air, and they make a lot of noise. But not owls. And everybody down here in this section is going to get a real close look of exactly what I mean in just a second. All right, I'm Marco. So we have Anna and Erica, and they're going to get a great opportunity. Did I get that right? Okay, good. They're going to get an opportunity of a bird flying right over their head. So guys, the bird is there. The owl is going to fly up to Marco out there. He's going to turn around and fly down the stage. So you're going to want to focus your cameras in this direction right here. Let's go ahead and practice and pretend my hand is an owl. This is where you'll see him. You guys see my hand? Okay, perfect. So now when you see the owl in your frame, go ahead and snap the shutters, but then get your cameras out of the way before the impact. <laughs> it's going to be fun. Feathers everywhere. The big bird right there. Ooh. All right, guys. So get those cameras ready. This happens very fast. Oh my gosh. Is that a great? Whoa. Whoa. Okay. You see this chair that Alfred is in? It's pretty tall, right? I tried getting up on that chair. It did not happen. But, Alfred says, put it on your bucket list. So, I'm going to put it on my bucket list to get on it, what, in about maybe four more months, come back? Before then. You think before then? Yeah. I don't know. Maybe 60 to 90 days. Okay. We'll do that. All right. See you on a little bit. We had an amazing, amazing time. Boy, was it hot. Hot, hot, hot. My face, you can see it's sweating big time. Uh, half of it was dripping. 84, <laughs> believe it or not. That, uh, that's hard to believe, as hot as it is right now. But uh, had a fabulous time. Wasn't out of breath. Rosemary, do you remember when we came in October? I was about to die. It was so hot and going up and down those hills. How did I do, babe? Fantastic. I did good, <laughs> didn't I? Oh, yeah. I amazed myself. I really did. I didn't think I could, you know, I thought it was going to be really, and then as hot as it is, I didn't think I was going to make it. But I can't get this camera straight. But um, I did, and I'm even proud of myself because I did such a good job. So who knows? He says we're coming back in about 90 days, so we'll see. <laughs> Now, if you could tell on my pedometer, I did over 5,000 steps. So that's like if I had gone to the neighborhood and walked two miles today. So we only did half of the zoo. The other half was the old part, and we went to the new part where the safari was, which was gorgeous. So um, I hope you enjoy all the pictures I took and um, the zoo in Dallas. So see ya. Love ya. God bless. Bye.